Good morning. This is Black Crow Walking coming to you from Australia. It's just after 5.30 in the morning and this is my happy time. This is my get up and go time. So we're up. I'm bringing you A Course of Love by Murray Perrin and we're up to Love, Return to Love, Chapter 32. And yesterday we read two verses, which took up a whole page, which was quite unusual for this book. And I wanted to just read you the last uh, last two sentences of yesterday's reading. Only in relationship are you uniquely you. Only relationship exists. For love is relationship. Love is relationship. We need to put that in our little program up here. Love is relationship. And only in relationship can you be uniquely you. Thus we end this course with love given and love received in truth. You are the learner here until you realise that you are love. The minute you realise that, you also realise that every, everything and everyone is love and that that energy that is love is experiencing life in form and out of form, formless. And it has always been here and it always will be here, in or out of form. You then become the teacher of what you are the teacher of love. Your mind and heart join in wholeheartedness, in the embrace. You are home and there you will stay forever and forever stay. You are love and when you truly get that, you begin to teach it and you, be go, you go from being the learner to the teacher. You then become realised as the mind and heart joined in wholeheartedness, in the embrace. You are home and there you will stay. And thus I say to you, amen. If we must get religious, <laughs> you have to return to love and your relationship with love has returned you to yourself, and that is true. That is the absolute truth. Think not. This course requires no thought and no effort. I like that. Think not. I think I'll go around saying think not today to myself. Think not. <laughs> it's a good one, isn't it? Think not. <laughs> Makes me laugh. This course requires no thought and no effort. There is no prolonged study and the few specific ex exercises are not required. This course has succeeded in ways you do not un yet understand and have no need to understand. These words have entered your heart and sealed the rift between your mind and heart. Be true to love and you cannot fail to be true to yourself. So I guess we could use it as a measure. Am I feeling love at the moment? Am I expressing love at the moment? What would love do here? What would love say here? What would love experience here? As you are the divine creator of your own life and your own experience and everything that happens to you is a creation of yours. And whether you created it today or you created it a long time ago with your thoughts and your words and your emotions, because that's how we create. We manifest today what our future is. And, and the manifestation is strong when we put our emotions into it. So this course has succeeded in ways you do not understand and have, not, have no need to understand. These words have entered your heart and sealed the rift between your mind and your heart. 
Be true to love and you cannot fail to be true to yourself. We're going to leave it there. So let's today have no thought. <laughs> have no thought. Think not. <laughs> Think not and play with it. You know, life is about fun. Make everything fun. And as you make things fun, you get it. You play with it, you get it. You play with it, everybody else gets it. <laughs> Think not. <laughs> All right, beloved. You are love infinitely and for all time. Well, that's a bit of a tautology. <laughs> but I love you. Bye for now.